The plane was heading to Orlando when an engine blew apart with 99 people on board and five crew members. And tonight we're realizing this could have gone very differently. News 6's Brittany Harris is live at Orlando International tonight. And Brittany, we are now seeing that something actually punctured the plane when that engine failed. That's right, Eric, and we're planning to show you those photos here in a minute. But like you mentioned, there was a piece of the engine that actually flew off and it crashed into the plane, causing a major gash in the side of the plane right where passengers were sitting. Fortunately, that piece of the engine didn't pierce through into the cabin. And if it had, we'd be telling you a very different story tonight. It's still unclear what exactly happened to the engine on this Southwest flight heading for Orlando, but passengers on board don't seem too worried about that right now. They're just happy they were able to land safely. Hey, God's good. That's all I got to yep. say. Faith Green and her husband were sitting in the back of the plane when they heard a loud boom and smelled smoke. A crew member then came over the speaker to announce that something was wrong with the engine and that they had to make an emergency landing in Pensacola. They also told everyone to put their oxygen masks on. Faith says people started panicking after that, not knowing if they were going to crash. The person across of us crying, saying he's going to die, and everybody trying to calm everybody down. Tammy Richards and her family were sitting right by the wing and had a clear view of the engine. She says they immediately started praying. I just knew that, I mean, God was in control and I knew he was going to take care of us. So whatever happened was his will and his plan for our lives. The plane landed about a half hour later and everyone on board was given a full refund and a $500 voucher. They were also switched over to another plane and brought here to Orlando. Richard says she's thankful to the pilot and crew for keeping them calm in such a scary situation. The uh, pilot, he was amazing. Um, Southwest has amazing pilots and he really, I mean, he saved our lives. And we also received an official statement from Southwest Airlines on the matter, and they basically said that uh, this was a mechanical issue uh, involving the engine. They wouldn't elaborate on that. We also asked if it maybe had caught fire or exploded. They said it's too soon to tell and that NTSB is investigating. Eric. And Brittany, I did some checking. Now, this was a Boeing 737. Southwest flies only 737s. Are they inspecting other planes in the fleet tonight? Have they talked about this? Well, we also asked the spokesperson for Southwest that very question, and he says they're not planning to inspect the other planes in their fleet, nor do they plan to. He just reiterated that NTSB will be investigating and inspecting that plane. And we'll see if that changes in the coming days. Brittany Harris live at the airport. Thank you.